Today in this video, we will learn a common way to measure the length of object by hand span. Children, we have to put a chart paper on the board for a program to be held in the school. Can you measure its width and length for that? Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, the width of this board is 6 hand spans and the length is 7 hand spans. Take this chart paper as per the measurement. The paper is big. How did this happen? I will measure again. Its width is 5 hand spans and its length is 6 hand span. Ma'am, why there is a difference between your measurement and ours? Can anyone think of the answer to this? Because there is a difference between your and our hand size. Your hand is big and ours is small. Exactly. Now, let's take a measurement and cut the chart paper from it. Children, now you also take an object like a cloth or a box. Ask each member of your family to measure the object with their own hands and fill it in your answers by making a table like this. Is the measurement of that object different from different family members? If so, why? Children, in this video, we learned the common method of measuring the length of objects by hand span.